If you wish, my homages will show you a list of goods we offer. It includes both spoils of war and the items produced by our orders craftsmen. I found the extirpators. The entire chapter perished fighting monsters. I see. I thank you for the information. We shall commit to it, pa it to paper. You were going to organize search parties, so it seems like you've saved us a considerable sum of money. I think it would be fair if we gave you a part of it as a reward. What can you tell me about Regil now, after the tribunal and his loss of rank? The paralictor gaze pensively drifts off for a moment. It was sad to see one of the most worthy representatives of the Orders fall. I must confess, I am surprised by what happened. Regil Drange usually gets his way. However, he immediately lost both his case and his title. At moments during the tribunal, it almost seemed like he was actually in control of everything that happened. However, perhaps I place too high a regard at his competence. I suppose it's never too late to reassess. Have we cleared up all the misunderstandings? What can I expect from the Hell Knights? We Hell Knights never let our guard down, and even when dealing with our most trusted allies, we have the highest possible confidence in your reliability and competence. We have sent significant forces to your aid, and we will not falter in our commitment. I'd like to see what your chapter is for sale, huh? Bell of Improved Protection. Ooh. Half Plate of Synergy? Edmund Team. Ooh. Durable Cover. Okay. Vigilant Watch. Spear. Battleforged. Warhammer. Full plate, Hell Knight helmet. Oh, shock long spear, tower shield, hole maker, heavy spiked shield, banded mail, dagger, long sword, blah, full plate, breastplate, tight bringer. Mm -hmm. This plus five axiomatic elder icy burst trident allows its wearer to cast tsunami once per day as an 18th level wizard. Oh! Ghost touch quarterstaff, adamantine full plate. Well, hello there. Nice. Hmm. Let's see what we got. Breastplate. Okay, I guess it's buggy. Okay. Tool plate five. And the helmet. Red Jill. Going to get a Hell Knight helmet. Ah, it's buggy. What if I remove it entirely? Will that solve the bugginess? <laughs> no, it will not. Okay. So <laughs> we're just going to stay with its buggy. Um, what about half plate of synergy? Okay, yeah, that does look interesting. Helmet of durable. Wait, what? Okay, so we have achieved infinite bugginess. What about the commander? Show headgear. Okay, we have achieved infinite bugginess. I'm thinking maybe we should uh, restart the game. But after this episode, it's just. That's a tad too buggy, even for my liking. Uh, of course, Regil's going. What just happened? Get back. Regil's going for the spiked shield. Uh, okay, no, he's not. What about the tower shield? No. Okay. <laughs> He's going to stay with the spellbreaker. Oh, what else do we have? Long sword. Vigilant watch. How does that one look? Okay. That's uh, no. Shock long spear. Mm -hmm. A long sword. Oh, it even glows. How long is the long sword? Long sword. Why doesn't it glow now? That's odd. Long sword plus five. Oh. A 
Ale Roblox. Sehr schön. 87 to 94. Holy. Okay. That's a worthy weapon. What about Tide Bringer? Mm -hmm. And our name is not Neptune, so it's not going to happen. And that's still infinitely buggy. Okay. Let's just call this a day. What? Okay, do we have um, another army? Ah, yeah, ah, okay, signifiers. Right, okay, so these are the super powerful units. I see. Hell oh, Knights, no, okay. So I guess we can recruit them from now on. Nice. I mean, they don't look very interesting, but still going to use them. Okay, what about our army? Can we now have, have a general? Oh, still one day four, okay. At least we can go there already. Uh, temporary dudes, please go. And Crusader 2, please go as well. Logistics reform, perfect. Development, okay, perfect. So we have to return to Dresden. Heavenly Warriors, perfect. Uh, development, I don't care about that. Studying the unusual crystal. The crystal the commander came upon holds many mysteries. Experts in magic and relics may be able to shed some light on some of them. Perfect. Relics. Um, the fate of the remains of the colorless one. And that's about it, yes. General's recruiters. Leadership. Okay, why not? In Scon Big Ah, we were here before came. Okay. <laughs> and you don't need to read this again. Sorry to bother you. I do what I must! Keep the alarm bell silent forever, Hevelathimos. When it rings, the fury of the metallic dragons will descend upon you. They'll protect the sacred child. Uh, 
I don't need to silence the bell, I'm going to destroy it, but you won't be alive long enough to witness its destruction. Stop! Stop him! Silver Dragon tries to rise, but he is too weak. He, he's a priest of Jahak! He wants to take the child! I am Hokugau Ruziplev! No, Hok... Hokwa... Hokugol Ruziplev! The protector of this cave. Sorry for the name. I beseech you, help me! Vanquish him! Protect the child! The black dragon turns it slowly into your direction. You wonder, why is there a game in a game with a story so significant that they just throw it at you 150 hours in and still expect you to be like, what? There you are, Commander, right on time. Need to finish off this worm before more of them appear. What a ch what child? Who are you talking about? The greatest treasure of... Are you kidding me? Dragon kind. The divine offspring. He has been asleep in his egg for centuries, waiting. Waiting to usher in a new era for dragonkind. Look at the bones scattered around you. These are the remains of those who fought for the right to keep the sacred child, and today the metallic dragons will lose this right. The chromatic dragons will be the new guardian of the divine offspring. What the? Um, what the heck am I supposed to do with him? Lathimouth, you're a dragon? Did you enjoy my little charade? I know how warm bloods feel about black dragons. I can imagine the kind of reception I would have had if I appeared to you in my true form. But I didn't lie you about my. I didn't lie to you about my work. I wish to change the future of our kind. The metallic dragons are hiding something that rightfully belongs to all dragons, and I'm here to retrieve it. You've come to seize the child. To make him a monster. Like your master, the huh? Do you think you can disguise your true intentions with all this talk of fairness? Your soul is rotten to the core, Everlastimoth. I have, um, questions. I will answer. Don't listen to him. I will tell you the truth. The truth? You're nothing more than a pawn, Hokugwa, Hokugo. You do what you're told and play your role dutifully, but you know nothing. And your name isn't even Jon Snow, so that's definitely bothersome. I uh, remind me, why is this child so important? The child is the subject of an ancient legend, at the dawn of creation, at the beginning of time. Two streams, order and chaos, came together and took form. They became the first dragons and gave birth to the gods, but Dahak, the eldest son, fierce and proud, refused to share his power. He destroyed as many of his brothers and sister as he, sisters as he could. But one lost egg was hidden on Golarion by his cowardly father, Apsu. Okay. The most of Apsu's worshippers are metallic dragons. Okay, 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 okay. No one knows what will hatch from it. A bringer of order, a bringer of chaos and destruction, no one knows. But when it happens, the future of dragonkind will be changed forever. This child will herald the dawn of a new era. No one can say when he's destined to be born, and so we keep him safe, hidden in secret caves. Um, okay. Your, your lot will never have the child. We won't let you corrupt him. We must... We must raise him with love, teach him to be kind and good, so that the world will prosper. This child is our future. Who said anything about corruption? Do you think my master, the Hak, was corrupted? No. 
he was born proud, raging, and free. So why is he so certain that the divine child will be any different upon his birth? The metallic dragons believe the egg was hidden by the cowardly Apsu. But what if it wasn't Apsu? What if Master de Hach hid the egg instead? Perhaps he knew that one day a worthy ally would be born. An ally who would help him overthrow his father. So he's obviously evil. I mean, first he has red eyes. And he's black. He has black. He's black dragon. Don't hit me on that one. Um, it's a black dragon. They're supposed to be evil in the Pathfinder universe. I didn't make the rules. Um, Lathimas, you're a priest of the Hak. I serve the greatest of dragons, Rageful Dahach, son of Apsu, the one whose breath set hell aflame, the one who shall unseat his father and usher in a new age for Galarion, an age of glorious conflict. Yeah, not, you're not selling yourself very good, decently. Doesn't the thought of it fill your soul with longing? At long last. We will unleash the pure rage, fury, and chaos in our hearts. We shall become free. Okay. Free? But at what cost? Galarion will be left in ruins. And, of course, he, for, he attacked him. He did the first step. He escalated the conflict into violence. So that's also not an argument in his... <clears throat> well favor why would you desire such freedom no mortal don't let him he wants to use the sacred child to destroy our world what is the alternative order and restraint for all eternity what a dull existence you metallics are so terrified of soiling your shiny scales you fear corruption you try so hard to always do the right thing you spend months deliberating over the right course of action that sounds perfect is this your idea of freedom? Pah! There is no freedom without chaos. Well, you, could, you can have chaos. In the morning, you have a glass of orange, a tea, and a coffee. And you take a coin with two faces. And then, when you see the result, you're like, well, I have three options. Now I'm fucked. And then you just ask someone else to tell you what to do. And that, that there, right there, is pure chaos. So you served chaos in the morning already without hurting anyone. Apsu made us slaves to order, but the Hach, the Hach shall set us free. And the sacred child will help him break our chains. What does that bell do? That bell will send a signal to the metallic dragons. Its sound will let them know that the child is in danger. Their presence will complicate matters significantly. Trust me, a fight with them would be a lot harder than beating up a half-dead guardian. You can't break it. The bell's enchantment protects it against dragons like you. Enough. I'll make it quick. I still have some unfinished business to take care of. I will help Hog... Hogugol, the keeper. I don't have the strength to fight, but please defeat him and take, take the egg. You have my blessing. Wait, are we going to get a dragon as a companion? I mean, that would elevate the game to extraordinarily glorious. You will pay for this, Commander! I will defend my dream! Perilicto, yeah, this is infinitely buggy. Uh, after this episode, I'm definitely going to... Close the game and open it again. I'm gone. Do it my way. Whatever. Please, game, please give me a dragonism and a companion, please.
soon as you touch the egg, it cracks. You watch a small, strong wings break through the shell, and then a tiny iridescent dragon emerges. He stretches as if he just woke up from a long sleep, and looks at you questioningly with his big violet eyes. Hi there, little one. Don't worry, uh, I will not let anyone hurt you. The dragon lets out a happy squeak and flaps his wings. His gleaming scales are the color of gold. He is watching you closely, and when you look into his eyes, a shiver runs down your spine. This is an ancient, powerful creature. A creature as old as time itself. Why is the egg huge and he's so small? Hogu... Hoku all look... Looks like he's about to collapse. A sacred child! He pauses and gazes at the little dragon in stunned silence, then he laughs with joy at witnessing more grain again, pronouncing something that he can't pronounce. Oh! Sorsigax Egamon Aliondre! That wasn't so bad, even though it was terrible. You little wonder, you finally decided to make your appearance. Sorsigax gleaming scales are no silver. He spreads his wings happily, but does his best to stay close to you. I see, I see. You, I've grown too old now and can't protect you as I once did, so you've chosen yourself a new guardian, if such is your will. I touched the shell and he hatched. Is that bad? Bad? No, 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 not at all. The child responded to your touch. He decided that it was finally time to emerge from his shell. This is a momentous occasion. Everything is about to change. Perhaps I should feel more afraid. Perhaps I should feel anxiety about the child's future and the future of all dragon kind, but surprisingly my heart is at peace. You cannot delay the inevitable indefinitely, and in his wisdom, Jaxi Jax What Jax Jax has already given us plenty of time to prepare for this day. Amber gazes at you pensively. Wherever you go, everything changes. Eternities end, some die and others are born. All becomes new and nothing stays the same. Who are you? It is a mystery. Don't be absurd, girl. Allah Commander isn't a mystery. He's the result of Aelo Volish's grand experiment. The architect of the world wound changes everything she touches. The Commander is here a creation. So he's also an agent of change. Jax. He already has a name? Yes, he does. A na dragon's name grows with them as they age. The older the dragon, the longer the name. Jax spent many centuries in this shell. He is an ancient being. He lived in this world during his long slumber, and that is why his name is so long at birth. You're speaking to him as if you know him personally. I have protected this cavern for many years. During my time as a guardian, Jax would appear to me in my dreams. I don't know how to explain it, but he would speak to me without saying a word. I've grown to care for him as if he were my own child. Hokugo lowers his eyes. I know it is disrespectful to speak of a divine being in such a manner, but guardians are always lonely. Jax is the only family I have. If he means that much to you, I'll leave him here with you. No, no. He's made his choice. He's chosen you as his guardian and teacher. The child cannot remain in his egg forever. He needs to grow and see the world. Can we get... Why? I mean, what the heck game? Is, he, uh, how, is Act 5 going to take me 100 hours? I mean, now I want to raise him and see him grow and be a big dragon and kill everything. I mean, what? Game, how can you give me something extraordinarily cool like this... At the supposed end? That's cruel. Or is, will the end take a while? We'll always remember. How can he choose anybody? He's an infant. He is a divine infant, not a duckling looking for his mother. He possesses the power of wisdom and his, of parents. Uh, just his faces and... You know, he sees things that we cannot perceive. I, I trust his choice. What am I supposed to do with him? Care for him. Raise him into a strong, magnificent dragon. A new deity of goodness and order who will make the world a better place. Now I can finally be at peace. My duty is done. You must look after the divine child. 
You will help him usher in the new dawn, uh, into the dawn of a new glorious era. Farewell, Oku Gol Ludziref. Farewell, Commander, and farewell to you, Jax. Grow big and strong and kind, just like your great father. The little dragon flaps his wings and farewell. What? Received item. Oh, item. It's not. Wait, what? My not a companion, okay. Paladin. Okay. Dum, 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 dum. Forgot one. Uh. Fire ability, uh huh? Hmm. Slashing grace. Yeah, no. Bear bashing cleaving finish. If you make a melee attack and your target drops to zero a few hit points as a result of your attack, you can make another melee attack using your highest base attack bonus against another opponent within your reach. Perfect. Ah, the nose is staggered. Ah, uh, don't. We will win this war. And sealer. Also paladin. Dum, 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 Greater weapon focus, improved cleaving fit. Why not? Whatever. T, whatever. You're a good person. Ember. Like yes. Dumb. Going to take a moment. Oh goodness. The mega. What the heck am I supposed to to give her? I mean, deflect arrows. Why not? Um. Animal servant, wh whatever. Summon monster nine, dominate monster, cure critical wounds mass. That's pretty powerful. Are we ready to move out? Ninjo, our wonderful friend. I still wonder who she is. Why is she forgetting everything? It seems like her story isn't finished at all. Um, proof no, she's um, she's a bow. Deflect arrows, sure. And... Power word kill. You utter a single word of power that instantly kills one creature of your choice. Whether the word can... Whether the creature can hear the word or not. Any creature that currently has 101 or more hit points is unaffected by power word kill. Avada Kedavra wants to know your location, huh? Uh, are you kidding me? You seeing this? Oh, they make game. Come on. <sighs> Tsunami. Done. I shall not be swayed from my path. Oh, Shale. You beautiful are going to get air. <sighs> hmm. Hmm. Well, I don't know. I uh, deflect arrows. D didn't we already have that archer? Uh, yes, definitely archer point blank master. Sure. I oh, know we already have that. Longbow quiet ability. Okay. Iron. Um. Hmm. Iron will. Critical. Okay, where is my longbow? Like, no, 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 longbow. Where's my longbow? Uh, acquired ability. Okay, so we already have that one. Okay. Hmm. Leave power to weapon combat, weapon and shield. Well, then let's go. Do 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 with toughness, whatever. Your orders, commander. And the mighty Rigil doesn't care about himself. He's going to improve his inquisitorness. I mean, he definitely is an inquisitor. We we didn't do so bad. 
the game. Mostly we made the right choices even though we kind of fucked up the secret ending already because we didn't notice that girl betraying us in the camp back then. Mm, deceitful, die hard, why not? And... Whatever. And of course our horse also needs new abilities for reasons I do not understand. The game wants it. Okay. Maybe we can make the horse a demigod in the end. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> that would elevate this game to magnificent beyond compare. Dragon Roar, Elven Spirit. Why not? Let's give him an Elven trait. He's, well, the horse has the blood of creation. Wait, party encumbrance? Um, something's going amiss. That's not possible. Overloaded. Wait, what? Travel speed reduced. Uh, well, that's mildly buggy. I have a solution. You might not understand that, but there's a press of a button. And it will lead to beautiful things. Turn, 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 turn. Done. Ha ha. Wait, what? She's still encumbered. Oh, that's pretty. Maybe she's too much gear, and that's causing ruckus. Oh, I changed her. Okay, I see the problem now. Stats. 24 okay that's buggy that's mildly buggy ah interesting okay so 125 is the max everything beyond that turns no, 125 is the only thing that makes sense. What? Well, that is indeed infinitely buggy, but I don't care. It works. Okay. So enough of that. Is that... Yeah, that's still buggy. Okay. Um, goals of piercing gaze. Okay, yeah, okay. We need to restart the game. Uh, Jax. Randomly provides additional cold, fire, acid, or electricity damage on a successful hit with a weapon. What? Well, hello, Jax. You are a very interesting one. We should move. Okay. Oh, both of them. <laughs> hello there. So we can't grow him into a big dragon, but still, this is cool. Follow if you dare. Uh, do we have any items here? Or is that it? Okay, this is it. There's something to read there. These look like humans. Who are they? Well. Ah, it's mildly buggy. This image depicts a man and a woman holding hands above a cradle. The woman's face has been scratched off and her features are impossible to distinguish. Okay. Cradle. Magnificent child and obviously the equivalent of dragons. I guess they were once brothers and then the metallic ones hid the child and the other ones, the black ones, were like, okay, um, that's going to cause a ruckus. Can we ring the bell for fun? No. Okay. I do well, I that was the dragon burial ground. Not exactly what I... Is that everything or is there a secret chamber? It kind of looked like a pathway to me, but there was nothing. Hmm. It's a bit odd, all of that. Okay. 
That was odd. Hmm. 